hi guys how are you doing welcome back to another video on my youtube channel if you're new here please consider subscribing if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for always coming back so i know i have been quiet for uh like two weeks or so this is because i have not been uh, vlogging i just didn't have the mood let me not come here and lie at you oh did this happen and what not I just didn't have the mood and I was uh, going through uh, some things that uh, normal people go through in life and I just didn't have that uh, that uh, urge of uh, picking up the camera and I've noticed that about me when I'm stressed I'm not productive at all I'm just like a lazy potato just seated there I don't talk to anyone I cry, I feel so bad about my situation, I feel so bad about myself, and that is something I should really work on because I really waste a lot of time and I really waste a lot of, uh, yeah, I really waste a lot of time just dwelling in one issue for a long time. And uh, yeah, so I don't know, I'm weak, I'm weak, you guys. I like crying. I like crying and I like just solving that issue at that particular time. And then uh, I get over and done with it. But when I don't solve that issue at that particular time and I see that it's going to uh, prolong, I become so emotional and I become so unproductive and I am just one boring person. I wouldn't want anyone to see me in that situation because you can really, really hate me. So that is why I have not been vlogging and uh, today I was just here after finishing some work I decided to pick up the camera and talk to you guys because I also don't feel good when I leave you guys hanging for so many days without communicating or uh, without just uh, giving you content and I know there are some of you or probably all of you who always wait for uh, me to upload content so that you can watch and uh, keep up and watch not and I'm sorry guys I'm sorry guys but at times life just takes a toll on you maybe all of us experience the same but just because I create content on YouTube and I am a familiar face maybe someone might expect me not to like dwell in uh, situations that bother me or maybe try and fix them behind the scenes maybe someone might think ah, but at times your body you have to listen to your body you have to listen to your mind because i don't want to come here and cry and maybe talk about issues that maybe later on i regret and uh, that is why i choose to be silent go through the process then come here and only just show you this i know there, there there are some moments where in this channel we become vulnerable to melia and stuff like that but there are some issues which occur like all the time and they are recurrent and i don't want to be coming and talking about them here all the time because i also don't want to give you negative vibes you know i hope you guys understand but i love you guys i love you guys so 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 much what is it that has gotten inside my eye I love you guys so 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 much and i appreciate you always watching my videos even if i get lost then i come back but that is something i'm really really working on so um uh, today i'm just chilling and i am from finishing work it's currently 12 pm today i got up very early after my daughter went to school i just started working because i do want to backlog and i also want to uh, prepare dinner today very very early and that is why i decided to do that so right now there is food in the fridge and i'm just craving chicken and <laughs> chips i don't know and i don't want to order i've tried ordering via bolt and uh, they're telling me that the app is temporarily not working so right now i want to go out there is a a cafe just uh, near our place and go and get a quarter chicken and chips and just eat and just eat because i have also not been eating that much yeah so i just want to eat actually i've been drinking a lot of hibiscus tea and what yeah hibiscus tea and just snacking on uh, crisps chocolates and whatnot and uh 
so today i just want to eat chips and a chicken so that is what i'm going to get then i come back and uh watch some uh, youtube videos just to get motivation because i've seen so many of my favorite people have uploaded videos and i'm like oh my god where i am where am i where am i so right now i just want to watch them so that they can give me motivation then um uh, i'm going to talk to you guys later but uh thank you so much for the love that you always show me thank you for the for liking and commenting and uh subscribing road to a thousand subscribers we are at 903 so i hope by the end of this month we will have already surpassed and that also calls for me i have to be consistent and also you guys when you share my content we will get to more than a thousand subscribers anyway guys i've spoken for almost six minutes let me go buy chips then i come back and uh, talk to you guys yeah guys so these are the fries and the quarter chicken i've already eaten uh, some so i'm not even going to plate this and the reason why i'm not going to plate this is because i had already washed dishes in the morning so i don't want any dirty plates in my sink until night time so i'm just going to eat it from here then once i'm done throw away the paper and uh, drink so much water then i uh, start doing other activities that i'm supposed to do so this slaps it slaps so bad more than kfc <laughs> come fight me <laughs> so guys one thing that uh the content creators that i always watch will do to me is make you salivate a perfect example is kate candy when you're watching her vlogs she always puts a disclaimer that uh don't watch her vlogs if you're hungry or probably watch her vlogs while you're eating something and uh, for a very long time i thought ah this lady is just talking mm. <laughs> yesterday i watched her vlog with my baby and my baby was like oh my god mom that lady is eating so many delicious dishes and i was like oh, oh. i should have warned her too because she was like all the time so right now i watched her vlog earlier on then i i was watching sarah guru and they went to a hotel and they were just eating and enjoying the food and i was like oh my god i just can't i also have to look for something so that i can uh, nibble on because these people will make you will make you feel hungry even if you've eaten something you'll have cravings and uh, if you're not very very disciplined that much with your taste buds and even your pocket you just end up buying something because you saw it on um, on the vlog but i'm happy whatever i see is not what i buy but i i buy something that uh is within my reach or i eat something that is within my reach and uh, something that will also that is very very tasty so that is what i do but in most cases i normally take water because <laughs> you guys these videos can really make you very very hungry so i'm just here eating and i already feel like i'm full of late i have not been eating so much so i think when i bombard my stomach with a lot of food actually it's just going to be painful so i've just eaten a like a little portion then the rest i'm going to keep and uh, eat later but after five minutes if i become hungry definitely i'm going to eat because i'm not going to deny my body food i'm not i'm not going to deny my body food at any given time in my life i'm not going to deny my body food so guys uh that's it and i am so happy when i see the growth that is happening to the youtubers because i'm in that space i started watching sarah guru in 2021 when she started off and uh, we were looking at her content and we were like oh my god this lady what not the way she was uh living in a very bad area and uh, they could not afford the fine things in life and right now she's living alone and she's enjoying so many things so i'm happy for her i'm happy for the growth that i can see people like nairo say people like um what geekon fashion i normally consume a lot a lot of content emily wawira 
Roda, why you are like people have grown so much on a on a YouTube that I feel so bad and not in a in a bad way like I'm envious or anything. I'm like, oh my god, I'm waiting for that type of blessing to come my way because I know I also deserve the best. And uh, the only thing that is keeping me from reaching that point is that I am not consistent. I'm not consistent and every other time I address that issue with the people who are close to me and they tell me, Faith, you're not consistent. Try, 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 try. Because one thing about me, I'm going to let my emotions dictate my life at that particular time, of which that is something I should really, really stop. So I'm so happy about the growth. I'm so happy when I see people just come from somewhere and actually it shows that uh there is something good on youtube so i'd urge anyone who wants to open a youtube channel right now while you're watching this please do open a youtube channel just do what you can put out content out there there's so many people who are going to relate to whatever you are putting out there because i normally say ah there's some people who will not get views and those people get a lot of views so there is nothing that will not attract your type of audience so guys if you want to open a youtube channel please do so so that we can be so many of us so that our cpm can go up and so that we can start earning more and more you know guys let me finish up this uh, small part then uh i'm going to see you later guys a few minutes after speaking to you the lights went off and they've just come back now so while i was waiting for the lights to come back because i hadn't even charged my phone they've just come back i've put it i've plugged in my phone and uh once it reached 10 percent nimeitoa so that i can speak to you guys so i decided to go and buy beans because i've just sat down and uh looked and uh checked what are we going to have for dinner they've like we've eaten so much ugali chapatis and whatnot so today i was craving rice and beans then you i make uh, a little bit of kachumbari of which i'm not sure because you've also eaten a lot of kachumbari um rice and beans then with avocado and i'm going to put coconut cream in my beans Eesh! that is going to slap so i've bought beans picked the bad ones from the good ones and already soaked it let me show you so this is how i have soaked it in this sufuria and actually because of time i'm going to use this hot plate to boil these uh, beans because i cannot use gas the normal gas we are saving in this economy and also i don't have a jiko so i am going to uh, just use uh, this hot plate i'm going to soak this for like one hour i'm going to cover it then soak it for like one hour then uh yeah after that we're going to have this for dinner so in the meantime what i want to do before my daughter comes because i only have like uh, one hour one hour is it yeah one hour i want to uh remove uh some of the clothes that were washed yesterday from the hanging line then uh just pick pick things here and there organize the house because i want when my daughter comes everything is clean because she'll ask me, mom, you've been in the house the whole day. What are you doing? They don't understand that you have other things to do other than these things that she's seeing are not done. So I wouldn't want her to judge me. <laughs> you know, children can really tell you things and uh, you're left wondering, eh, what is wrong with me? <laughs> what kind of a mother am I? So I just want to uh, unhang those clothes because uh, the sun is also very, very... Uh, so i just want to unhang those clothes then uh put them aside i'm not going to fold them right now i'm going to wait for my sister to come and assist me i know she's going to be very mad because she gave me that warning when she left like but who am i i don't listen so i'm just going to unhang the clothes put them aside then uh clean the house here and there move things here and there then once my daughter comes, I'm just going to give her all the attention. We are going to do homework. We are going to snack together. Then, yeah, that will practically be my day. So let me unhang the clothes. Um, my house is also very, very, very cold. Very cold. I don't know. Let me just go sit at the balcony while I unhang the clothes so that I can feel all the heat that is outside.
and Simone is on tonight. Thank you.